What's good with you guys? We'll go back to another brand new. But today we're going to go to kind of um. So if you guys don't know, we're looking for the um. Okay, so where did we buy our tickets? Okay, there we go. What's this really is why can I stand in the post of the Imperial ability? And I thought there were limits how unpleasant a single person should be. Ha! Huh. No, you took the words right out of my mouth. Tell me why the Republic would even care about the engines. Uh, Provisions deal. I did not think liberals and turn you no know, po politics were so plain. This is a matter of national, no, international security. Security, of course. It hasn't even been. A decide, decided since your glorious imperial attempt to and this this innocent little country is absolutely unacceptable for the half barbaric nation like yours to lay their hands on such a cutting edge technology. No matter how how friendly you may try to be these days. We will not sit back and watch this happen. At Babar. We didn't even have any soldiers involved in the war. How dare you bastard like you act as you have any right to judge our conduct. But you just My Lord <clears throat> Ambassador, Ambassador Kreen, Ambassador, just we leave the matters here. We do not wish to bother the other customers, but Miller, we Ambassador Crop Country, may I ask that you back down as well? It is a debate. That could handle just as well through Ambassador. Very well. I was. I like to say. I can't say I don't like hearing that from a member of the Imperial military. Still, far better hearing it from that prosper and gluttonous member of the nobility, I suppose. What did you just. Well, gentlemen, if you pardon me. The Estrofino Seawolf. It's just a consider with no history or tragic tradition art. My lord. Oh, yes, yes. Okay. I shall return to the ambassador. I trust I can't leave the other matters in your hands. As you wish, my lord. Uh, hiya. Ah, uh, still, yes. Is this a time set? The time since the martial arts competition, I believe. <laughs> I'm glad that you remembered. What the heck was that argument just now, though? Who were those two, and why were they going to each other like cats and dogs? The man is an ambitioner of the 
Erebonian Empire of Liberal. The Lord De Devil is Kenny. She will be a ambassador from the Republic of Catva, Isel, Isla, whatever. I know. It's a. Uh, I'm not good at kind of pronouncing these names because you know they pronounce different than how they spell. Let's head up to their respective uh, invest here in the capital. Oh, uh, here's this team. Off for them childish for a couple of investors. Can those really? Can I still really get to their job? Hey again. I wish I could disagree, honestly. To say that the empire in the republic has always been on bad terms would be an understatement than the best times. On top of that, those two are like oil and water on a personal level. Well, no. The fact that into the argument every time they show how similar they are in some way. I guess you can say that. No, it caused I'm walking in the middle of the conversation, but I can understand. Like, after that, I'm thinking about ancient position and liberal. I said I get to shoot. No, I don't mind. There you go. Anyway. The engine in question actually. The late is an old special factory. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, I gave him a wrong voice. My bad. Once it is they're financed, finalized the sample units are company and Empire Republic. Both, but we here. But it's a camera. So, yeah. We finalized the details of the deal. I get it. Why the big argument about an engine then? The Orwell ship's engines is what? <clears throat> an Orwell ship's engines would determines what the ship's gonna really do. Since you can install them in military ships, easily don't just hand them like candy. No, I get it. It really be a real mess if that engine lets the Imperial Army get all the power. Of eh, what well, I mean? Not at all. It's true. Normally, it's doing such advanced technology with other countries so freely would be unthinkable. But it's part of your queen's plan. Rather than monopolizing a techno technically edge, she wants to provide it with other countries to promote medication peace. At least that's her plan. And I understand it. I get it. She mentioned something like that a while ago. Now that you do think about it. Hmm. It's pretty incredible that the queen is willing to try something like that. Well, I understand that, but aren't we supposed to be searching for a uh, society group? Like, it's not just an idea, you know? It's something that could really change how people... Negotiate. Yes, you have a reason to be proud of you. To be proud of you, Queen. My apologies, but this conversation has gone long enough than I intended. You're here on the air. Air ticket, yes? I pardon myself here. Oh, uh, yes. Say, Mirror, about Oliver. Has it gone back to the Ar Arabonian already? What, have you not heard? No, I really have. 
I really had a chance to see him the Queen's point this time last game, actually. I felt kind of bad about it. Don't worry. That half wit is continuing to. That half wit is continuing to while the stays here in the He said he was going to visit the Elder Spring. If I remember right. Okay then. Eh. Yeah, that sounds like Oliver, alright. Did he ever bother to turn into an ambassador? Like a responsible citizen like unlikely as it is I'll let him know you were asking about him I'll make sure at least he contests you before he returns to the empire thanks man hardly I should be thank you for keeping that limited company now if you excuse me That was a hell of a state military type boyfriend of the golden hair guy. Who is he? Mueller is the Mueller is the represent military officer for the Empire Embassy, I think. I only ever met him a few times myself. Well that built well built and he made sure not to leave himself open at any point in our chat. Well trained dog of the military and hiding some sharp prank to boot. Here you go again. He does like his re like like really strong though. Tuh. I don't trust any Imperials. And that includes Blondie. Damn. It seems he like to talk to Cassie's about something. But who knows what his plans is. We we'll all stand so long. I guess that's the good point. Although Oliver may be weird, but I can but I can't think of him as a bad guy. Even Mueller doesn't seem at all that Malinvantive, I guess. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Let's go to the counter and get our ticket. Welcome. Will you be using a national flight or a international flight? Two tickets to the Balfour Run, please. Understood. Oh, pardon me. Are you the British ticket? Yes. Ah, oh, still again. Yes. Oh, I received payment from Elton of the Capital Branch. Here's your ticket. I see, so Aiden did. <laughs> nice. Aiden, he's already hit. What a, please hand over your tickets to the re receptionist immediately outside the building. Now you can check on the flight. <laughs> Well, hello and welcome. Will you be flying with us today? Oh, flying with us today? If you are, we need to check it in and present your ticket. Once we check in, we should stick around and wait for the ship. You should get everything you need. <laughs> Very well. Please sign these papers then. Yeah, sure. <laughs> scratch, scratch. Thank you. Everything's in order. Please wait in the our board area, and then it should arrive. Okay. Right then, let's find a good bench and wait for this. Trip. Are we waiting? Talking. Josh was out there doing God knows what, doing you know what, you know who. I am a little bit more curious what Joshua's intentions, like what's he doing, and all that other stuff. Alright, 
like that, so now we on the flight. <clears throat> This is, this is safe. It's always a goddamn talk scene. You talking to motherfuckers? Ah, oh, what a nice day. The tourist gotta be running the streets of the world. The world is messed like this. Maybe. They got a bigger day. He in the place of the tourist, though. Other than tourism? What do you mean? The election for the new mayor. Apparently, there are two popular candidates to replace all of Delmar. So it's like an actual fight for the election meet. And think, and thinking about it, I guess it is time. About time, huh? They can just let the mayor officer sit empty. Yeah, the whole thing has been a big of a mess ever since you guys blew that case wide open. I heard about what you guys did from Gene. <laughs> yeah, after after you left me and Joshua and Chloe. Th thank you, Chloe. That worked that out. I said Chloe. I said Chloe the whole time. I feel I feel silly. Well, we had some help from the report too. And actually an actual arrest was done by LT LT Swart Charles Swart from the Royal Guard. Even better. It's smart enough to see it was all just you. By Chloe though, you mean the girl in the uniform, right? AKA Presta Claudia? Man, that blows my freaking mind when I heard that ca heard that in the castle. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. <laughs> oh, <laughs> hey yo, y'all remember when this man Joshua was in the dress? Like, my man Joshua was in them heels, and then like they kind of just, and then you know they kind of like whoever made that play got dumb. My man Joshua felt a certain type of way about it. And then Sylph was like, I'm so nervous. She was like, you do your best. She was like, yeah, you know, I can just imagine. She was like, just think of something. He was like, all right. I'll think about the boy in the dress. She was like, really? You don't think about Okay. Yeah, that's, that, that works. You know, I have a Chloe's since the birthday festival. Or Oliver, I guess. For better or worse. And not just them. Tita, too, and Zane. I told Tita her old fugly about what was with you. What's up with you? I figured they were too much if they were kept in the dark. I guess everybody knows about Josh. I guess, oh, that's where I guess you do just went up and left. Huh, thanks, again. Yeah, well, you better send them um, a letter or meet them in person or whatever. They miss you. Oh, and Zane went back to Calvary after the festival. He said to give you his best. I see. I wish I could have said goodbye. As for the princess, I think I heard she was going back to the academy. We'll be in Rome for a while, so I think we can find some time to drop by and say hi. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> oh, did I say something funny? No, not really. I oh, don't give them this eyes. I'm giving this eyes, baby girl. First, she was first. I, wait, Estelle, wait, so don't go to the streets, Estelle. Because first of all, she was all up in Joshua. I need my Joshua. Oh, Joshua, how could you leave me? And then she went to, uh, baby girl, she was like, okay, okay, I guess we can. Let me think about it. And now she going for Agen, too. Blushing for Agen. Whatever. I was thinking, you're a lot more thoughtful than you look, Agen. Even 
You even went a that little shopping trip before we I left the capital. Golf ball. I'm not. I mean, I am. Ah, oh, forget it. Whatever. I was just going to take a nap by the sea until we arrive. Don't get so absurd and wandering around that you forget to get off the run. Hey, again, you really don't try too hard sometimes. Anyway, I think let's take a spice. Time for a bit looking on before we arrive. Oops, I. Oh, by the way, so, um. Well, never mind. Y'all yeah, won't get it. I can't, I can't. Uh, I look, you want to play a trick on him. Oh, he up here. Okay. I mean, so that's going to take a nap. At least we ain't walking, though. At least. Oh. But look at Lake. Who's Lloyd? Somewhere that was over. Lake, a legendary king of the. About. Valeria, what a live. Someone has to change a bit. Hmm? Oh, I was wondering who it was. Hello, still. Hey, Lloyd. I haven't seen you in forever. Look for a challenge to Lord King Ma Womp Fish of Valeria Lake again? <laughs> for now, no. I'm off the road. I find this, this a nice. Conventian fishing spot within the city limits. Wow, you sure are dedicated. Oh. Sounds like fun, but I can't see myself traveling like that with just with just to fish. I mean, I like fishing, but still, I see. That's a pity. You got quite the talent for it. From what I saw in the king fishing in. I knew you would. Let me give you this. Huh? This is a... Uh, it's a rod for beginners and a notebook for recording your fish record. We, the members of the fishing, fishing guild, fishermen guilds, are dedicated to the expansions of the culture of fishing. We always have to provide promising rookies with the tools of the trade. Incidentally, you are bound for more. Yeah, I am actually. Well then, you'll have a chance to swing that rod right away. There are all sorts of fishy spots at Rowan. I guess it will be a good chance, now that you mention it, Ruin has a region, it's kind of full of water studies in the area. Like I said, there are a fishing hole within the city itself too. You should go there first to practice. But now, as long as you enjoy it enough, that's enough. Yeah, thanks, I'm definitely giving it a shot. I pray, I pray you'll join our ranks someday. Well then, say, Alright. Okay. Uh what's in here? Yeah, 
Excuse me, miss. Yes, I am. I thought so. I'm glad we can meet again. You remember me? I was the one who, who of the people you say when the sky bandits was kind of hostage. Oh, you were with you with the captain, right? That's right. I'm Claire. I'm the manager of passenger cop. Our entire crew owes you our lives and more. Even though nobody's in this motherfucker actually driving. What the hell? <laughs> You're welcome. It's the entire crew of the land back to work. Yes, everyone's is working even harder than before. That's great. I'm going to see their way to tra traumatize by the hostage. No one's driving. Damn. Forgive me asking, Miss Bracer. Are you traveling for pleasure today or for work? Eh, unfortunately, it's always work. I probably end up riding the airship a lot from now on. I hope you'll treat me well if I end up on the land again. Absolutely. I hope we can serve you again. I got you. Oh, my bad. Okay, I can't. All right, nobody driving this motherfucker, so we all we we'll going down. Oh, let's driving through here. Okay, so yes, yeah, some of the people that we saved, yeah. Oh, ain't nobody driving this motherfucker. Anyway, driving this motherfucker. Oh, damn. Took my words. Wait a second, you're that girl from before. Hi, sir. I'm you in a minute. You saved from those bandits in the hideout, right? Yes, of course. You must forgive me. I never got the chance to properly thank you. Allow me to offer my thanks on behalf of the entire crew. You're welcome. It was really just doing my job, though. Oh, boy. The only reason why you and Joshua took that job in the first place is to save your daddy. And your daddy was on the board, on the ship. That was a funny coincidence. Taking a trip on the same airship that once was held rescue. Repairing the damage as though his dogs did. It took some time. But, uh... Lynn's as good as new. Uh, I sure do do her best with any board. Ah, it's like he's heard us talking. And do stuff like this today, we should probably arrive alone in no time. Please enjoy the rest of your journey and let us know if you need anything. I will. Thank you. All right. Uh, stream talking. What about this guy? He ain't really talking. Okay. Alright, I don't see nothing else for us to do. Let's stop this guy. What happens if we go to A again? What happens if we go to A again? Up there? Oh, it's not A again up here. A again is upstairs. He's already completely passed out. All right, let's make the ship a little quicker. I talked to these people upstairs already. Did I talk to you? Thank you for flying with us today. We will be arriving rolling shortly. Please be aware there are temporary lanes while well, they so we are all passengers so take your seats well medicate to my seat ah good old that's for olive oliver's still here 
my boy Zane, he went back to the went back to Japan. I want to say he's from Japan or China. The fact that he's talking about chopsticks and all that stuff is obviously from China, Japan, or from another Asian country. Oh, hey, welcome back, boy. But I'm glad you guys are here. China's been waiting for the boys cover with jobs. You guys have work cut out for you. Gear up and you're ready to go, I hope. <laughs> then else out already. We were expecting a little board work too, but anyway, an urgent has come up lately. Well, no, we, we snowed under with work in general, but none of it's particularly urgent. I mean, the election's being held under the eyes of the minister anyway. The, the town's so busy blowing over the election and that the tourists have to stay away a bit. Well, the election's gotten that hot? Who's running? We haven't heard. Let's see, Mr. Norman, who is a proponent of the tourist induction, and Mr. Potis, who has tried to revive the humble in business time. Remember, this is, is a big deal. The mayor of Rowan is also the governor of the entire region. People in me and itself are going to. It's been a real media circle. This election is basically going to decide on the future of Rowan. It's exciting. I get it now. It's that big? Well, given that under underage and not a citizen of Rowan, I guess I can't vote. I gotta admit though, since since I um, basically helped cause this, I saw it because they're curious to see where it goes. Oh, read the Covering from the liberal news there They're investigating the article. All right, excellent Investigating wait that reminds me There is a job like I like for you to focus on isn't it? it is urgent, but there's something I need you to look into. Well, huh? What is up? Well, I just put this It's hard to explain maybe I should have the heck Ain't, ain't you like get beat around the bush, Gene? Since we do, since when do you hesitate on piles of work? Come on, spell it out. Well, <laughs> thanks for your honesty, I think. All right, here it goes. Here it is. I want you to investigate a ghost society. I say I knew you were going to look at me like that. This is why I didn't want to bring it up. No, sir, I just a bit of a surprise, so. So, uh, what exactly do you mean by ghost study? Okay, okay. So, okay, so it began about two weeks ago. We've been receiving reports that people have been seeing a white shadow at night. And not just in the city of Rowan. You mind, reports have come in off the cross They saw a white shadow at night? What you mean? Ah, so that's why you said it goes. And it's, it, it's probably it's a prank or a trick on the eye. And people are seeing this thing all over. Exactly. I have to dismiss one sighting. But with all of your report we've gotten, all you travel around working on other jobs, do you think you could follow on a few 
Your ports? Well, uh, you see, it did irresponsible for us to take such a job and such a such so much going on. Well, yeah, that's it. I said, are you? Uh, no, 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 not at all, not at all. I think you think Estelle the Cowbreaker hero of liberal will be afraid of ghosts? No, wait, no, how? No. Hey, right, I'm afraid of ghosts a little. <laughs> More than a little, from the looks of it. <laughs> I'll be afraid of... <laughs> if anything, I'll be afraid of the bad guy in this game. We only own chapter one. Well, don't worry. Nobody's been hurt or anything. It isn't urgent. We'll just pretend this conversation didn't. No, we'll take it. Forget. Don't forget. It's a big part of our mission. It's investigate. Secure. Society. We have to keep an eye out for even the slightest hint of activities from there. That's his plan. Remember. Oh. Everyone has things they have trouble handling. Everybody one. But don't be afraid to admit it. You're scared of something. But admit it and do something about it. Instead of just running away from it. I like I, I like Egan and I don't like him at the same time. Like I like him, but I don't like him. Oh, it's a little harsh, don't you think, Egan? No, Egan's totally right. I'm afraid of ghosts, but no ghosts can match the terror terror I felt the day Joshua disappeared. Still, <laughs> now you get it, Team. We'll investigate the site. The slight exciting at the bar and get to the bottom of it i promise i'm glad to hear it anyway i've got three sightings in particular that i think bear looking into first is report at the guard the air landing apparently he saw something during the night the party that spooked the heck out of him okay not scared, not scared. And the second one I saw at the sighting is by the member of the Raven. I figured that should be easy since Agus is with <laughs> He doesn't talk like talk out remind the guy who the real boss is. Tie it out, Machi stuff. It seems kinda different during the tournament. And guess though, you know? Yeah, I kinda doubt it. Well, uh, try to do. Well, uh, do try to be subtle about this. Last report is from one of the children at Merciless Orphanage. Like one of the orphanage kids? Oh, um, I'm not gonna read that now. Contact us on her behalf. What I guess what no recognitions of the orphanage is finished. Not that long ago, according to there is theory. Uh, it's more or less exactly as once was. Is it a relief? I gotta say hi to there's some kids anyway. I'll ask them about things and slice when I when I go graduate them over a new orphanage building. And that's it. Remember them. It is remember urgent. It's an urgent so you can put it off for a bit. Come. The rest of the job is on the board. Make sure you check it. We are, we will not be doing that. Once I heard with three witnesses and said, please come here. And go over the testimony and task figuring out the mess. Understood. The Ravens hangouts in the warehouse district. Right, the warehouse district. 
Let's move out. All right, we're gonna end the video here. So you got your Smith Jeff, like subscribe, guys. You're coming up below. Until next time, Ooh, bye.